Hey y'all, it's Ashley, and today I took all of the makeup products that I received in my Christmas swap box and used them to create this look. So if you want to see what those products were and what exactly I did with them, you are in the right place. Just keep watching. <laughs> So if you haven't seen the video where I received and opened my Christmas swap box, I'll link that up here and down there. You should definitely go check that out. Um, and that video and this video are both collaborations with Tina Mon. She also posted an unboxing video the same day that I posted my unboxing video. And the same day that this video goes up, she will also be posting a video using the products that I sent her in her box to create a look as well. All right, but real quick, in case you haven't seen that video or just for a refresher, I do want to show you the things, the makeup products that I received in that box. So first I have this green eyeliner from e.l.f. Then I have a silver glitter liner from Hard Candy. We have the fully charged mascara from Pure. The Maybelline single eyeshadow in the color Forest Green. The Pure Revolution palette. And then she sent me one of her DIY Z palettes, which I love. Um, she sent me this highlighter, which is here, Kitty Kitty from ColourPop, and these two eyeshadows, Pumpkin Pie and what was it? Intergalactic. And these are both from Colored Rain Cosmetics. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and get started with the look, and I am so excited. I don't really even know where I'm going to go with any of this yet, but we'll see. I'm sure it'll be great. <laughs> I think first I'm going to take this eye, not eyeshadow, eyeliner from e.l.f. and do my waterline real quick. For my eyeshadow, I'm going to start with this palette, and actually, specifically, I'm going to start with this color. Okay, so far so good. Now I'm going to take the same brush and I'm going to dip into the color about face sorry by the way these shadows have names the first one was called flux so now i'm going to be using the same brush and going into about face and placing that in my crease as well but i'm not going to blow it out all over i'm just going to keep it in the crease area just going to use those two colors from this palette. I think they made a good base for my crease because I think that now I'm going to go in with this really bright orange called Pumpkin Pie from Color Grain and I'm going to step like so far out of my comfort zone and I think I'm going to use this orange and this green together to make just like a really vibrant festive kind of look and I'm gonna um zoom you in a little bit more too so you can just see what I'm actually doing a little bit better <laughs> Thank you. 
And now I think I'm gonna go ahead and go in with that green. <laughs> going to I think take the orange and put the orange on my lower lash line I'm actually gonna go ahead and use this here kitty kitty highlight from ColourPop to highlight my brow bone and inner corner. Why not? So next I'm going to be trying the, well actually I'm gonna do the hard candy glitter liner. I'm not great at liner, so we'll see how this goes. This might just wind up being glitter all over my lid. We'll see. Alright, I did it on one eye. Woo! Let's see if I can do it a second time. <laughs> Okay, so I'm not gonna lie, I just both surprised and impressed myself. All right, I guess, um, yeah, I curled my eyelashes a little bit ago, so I'm gonna go ahead and try this Pure Fully Charged Mascara now. left to do now is to try this highlight on my face. I'm so excited. All right, baby dolls. Well, that is everything that came in my box. I really honestly loved everything. I love this look. I loved all of the products. I'm so excited. I really hope that Tina winds up liking the makeup she got in her box as much as I loved all of this because I like am genuinely in love with all of this and this look. Ah, love it. All right, well, thank you so, so much for watching. Remember to go and check out Tina's channel and video. I will be linking that up here, down there, everywhere. <laughs> and of course, please subscribe before you go and be sure to turn notifications on so you never miss a future video. And of course, if you have any questions or any ideas or suggestions about videos you'd like to see on my channel in the future, leave it in those comments down below. And if you liked anything about this video, me, Tina, the makeup, the look, anything, please be sure to give a thumbs up. It really does help me out more than I can say. I love you all so, so much. Thank you for being here. I'll see you again soon. Bye.